Hello and welcome back to Minecraft and Survival episode 10. We are here in the little hidey hole that I made in the last episode. And I have been cooking up some shadow berries. There we go. I now have 13. Hopefully I'll be able to get some more. Now before we go ahead and leave this hidey hole, I do want to check out a few things. I was told that I shouldn't have used the thalassium to make the axe. Because it's apparently able to be made into... The uh, terminite? Question mark? I can. So in the endstone smelter, you can combine thalassium with ender dust and get terminite ingot. So if I go ahead and uh, combine the chest plate, for example, actually the sword 5.5 attack damage, 1.6 attack speed. Now, if I then go, uh, the terminite. It's actually a lot better. 7 attack damage, 1.6 attack speed. Let's compare the axe then. 10 attack damage, 1 attack speed. And if I then go ahead and actually spell things right. Okay, so the the um, the Terminite is actually a lot better. Let's compare the armor. Plus 5 armor is on the chest plate. Plus 7 armor. And plus 1 armor toughness. Plus 0 0.5 knockback resistance. Okay. Well, thank you very much for those comments, because that that's very important right there. <laughs> we will have to make some more Terminite tools and whatnot in the future. But before we go ahead and move on, I do want to see if it's possible for me to make an enchantment table. I know I can get obsidian, obviously. I can get obsidian because we're in the end. If I don't find it, I can get it at the main island. I could get the diamonds. Question is, can I get the paper? Yes, I can in fact get the paper. Now, can I get the leather? Apparently, I can get leather from Leather Stripe. Um, but I don't know how to... Oh. Okay. So, apparently, I am not able to get leather here in the end. Um, yeah, that's a little bit unfortunate. I was hoping I could actually make an enchantment table. That would have been pretty cool. But who knows? Maybe we can find one in a structure since the structures have indeed been replaced by that data pack, which is really cool. Um, but anyways, let me pack things up here. And do I have any ender pearls? No, I do actually not. Oh, hello, fella. Hello. I've got to come in here. I think not. I really think not. Um, there's a lot of them. <laughs> uh, I could actually use some more wood. Um, but these guys are really creepy. Hello. Hello. Can't see. I really need to be careful of this hole right here. Because that, that would be that would be pretty bad if I were to fall in that. So let me go ahead and get some more wood. Purple polypore? Made to make purple dye. It can also be composted. Okay, that's cool. I'll keep that. Alright, hopefully this should be good enough in the wood for now. So we can actually go ahead and move on in our journey. Oh, I will grab these though. More food needed. Ah, what did I touch? Uh, let, let, let's get an, ah, let's get out of this biome, shall we? So in the last episode, we checked out that area and we saw some pretty interesting stuff. Whoa, hello. I can't see anything. We checked out that island over there, and there were some pretty interesting things. Um, we saw some new red island, that island um, color biome thing over there, which I really want to check out. And I need to remember that I also have this mini map, so it was right over here somewhere. Um, plus, I want to check this out, so I think I should probably turn around, move down here, and then move over like this. It's gonna be a little bit of a dangerous journey, but. I think it is possibly going to be quite worth it. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, whoa. Hello. At least the blindness doesn't last for too long. So let's go ahead and do that. And I will be right back if something interesting happens. And I will, of course, be collecting berries on the way. Because we will be needing the food. And also I'll collect the seeds because why not? Now, there's a slight issue, and that is that I don't currently have any more ender pearls on me. So, unless I find some endermen that I can kill to get some ender pearls, I'm going to be stuck here, and I will be forced to make um, 
and make it almost bridge over, which I don't know if I feel comfortable doing with these guys around. I have actually just found some Endermen, so I will be taking the shot here. Uh, didn't get anything out of that guy. I got one from him. Okay, that's good. And pearls are in general a good thing to have because uh, they could be kind of a safety net, right? Yeah, I need to go this way. Oh, even more Endermen. All right, we got to cross this. I can't see anything. Let's throw that. Hopefully it lands. It does. All right, perfect. So now I should be able to continue this way and be able to get over here pretty easily and get to this ship that we also saw in the last episode. Well, we didn't see it. We saw it on the map, but you know what I mean. All right, here we are. Um, yeah, that looks really, really interesting. Definitely want to get over there. It seems as though the biome generation is being a little bit wonky. Um, maybe because I updated the mod or something? Oh well, it can happen. At least it's not totally broken. Um, I need one more enderpearl. I thought I had one. Uh, looks like we have a few endermen over here. Alright, it actually seems like this is some sort of cave. Now, okay, this is obviously not supposed to happen, but that's what happens when you update a mod <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> that is in development. Um, but it does look like it's some sort of cave generation, so this is actually quite exciting. I will read what I get over there to that island. Um, and yeah, then maybe we can continue forward and um, yeah, hopefully the whole world is not going to be like this. <laughs> Alright, I have two ender pearls. I'm going to throw one. Hopefully it's going to land and not get us in the void. Nice, perfect. Sweet. Alright, let's take a look at what we got. Obviously, this is the orange biome, so maybe we'll find some amber here, which is definitely needed. We have more thalassium. Not really intro. Whoa, what was that? Wait a minute. I think we've been looking for those crystals. Have we found the biome that we have been looking for? Hold up. Okay, so we have more of that cave thing up there. Looks like we have some building over there. Oh, this is a whole new biome. Oh. Okay, one thing at a time. First things first, I want to check out the red cave area thing that we saw over here from the other side. Perfect. I found it. Ow. Okay, so that is where we were. That's the island we were at in the last episode. What is this? Cave mod. So it is a cave. Spe what? Smell wreck? And crystal shard. Oh, I can't break them. I can't take them. I don't have anything with silk touch. Oh, there we go. Are these used for anything? No, does not seem like they're used for anything. They do seem to give off light though, so that's pretty cool. Um, if we could find some amber down here, that would be cool as well. What do we have over here? Oh, we do have some amber right here. Sweet. We do need quite a lot of this actually. So any that we find is really, really good. I hope I don't miss any. Has some more amber over here. That's perfect. We also have some end. What are these called? End end ores as well. Definitely want to take those. That is a little bit close to the edge. I really want to get over to that crystal as well because I do believe maybe I don't. I don't know actually where we get these crystal shards, but maybe that. I don't know. I don't fully know yet. And I think I may allow myself to take a few of these crystals with me. Just because they look really, really cool. Um, yeah. We have these stale stalactite. <laughs> uh, also definitely want to check... Oh, look at those slimes. Definitely want to check out that as well. So I think we'll be enderpearling over there very, very soon. I just want to get maybe one more crystal before we head out. Maybe two. There we go. I'm happy with that. Uh, I think I need to go back to the surface. I don't think I'll be able to end the pole from down here. All right, I believe this area over here will be our next stop because we did have the structure over there as well. We do have the end ship, probably what we saw. And I also want to see what that weird crystal is that is like down here, I think it is. Yeah, down there. Um, definitely want to check that out. So I think I'm going to try and end up over. I'm a little bit scared that I'm too far away. But I'm going to try and end up to that place right there. Oh, it does seem a little bit far, doesn't it? Oh, well, here goes. 
boy. Oh. Oh, perfect. Okay. What is this? Jade stone. Jade stone. Looks like we can make some brick stairs. We can use it as normal stone as well. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, gave me my pickaxe back. So we have Vira Jade Stone, we have Sandy Jade Stone, and we have Azure Jade Stone. Oh, this is some cool stuff. This could be used for some cool building materials. What do we have down here? More crystals. This purple cave area again. Very, very nice. I'm gonna go through here if I can without possibly dying. Oh dear, this is... This is, um... This is quite dangerous work right here. <laughs> This is not safe. Okay, and here we are. What is this tree? La Cook Grove. Or a Lazy Grove. Let's shoot. Let's dip. Deep it a bit. I don't know. <laughs> what does the wood look like? Is not that what we had in the end uh, tower? This wood right here? I think it looks really, really cool. And I think I'm going to take like 16 with me, maybe? 32? Going to dig out one of these roots here. Uh, don't know if I'm able to get the sapling or not. Um, I may not be able to, which is fine. We can always come back for saplings and stuff like that later as well, if we need it. All right, look at this water as well. Let's take a look here. So we have end lotus leaf. Oh, we have jellyfish. Hello, for ow. Okay, you hurt. Okay, you're you're evil. You're mean. <laughs> What are these? End lotus flower. Wait, can I eat these? End lotus seed. Hold on. End lotus seed. I wonder if I can eat those. Looks like the flower is growing here. End lotus flower as well. I want to take a few of these. Maybe we can grow them. It doesn't look like I can actually use, like, get the flower. Maybe if I have silk touch or something. I also want to see what happens if I kill these jellyfish. Do I get anything? No. What is this? Wet... Wait. Wet sponge? What is this? Hold up. We're discovering new things. Can we use this for anything? So apparently this is just like some, some sort of sponge here that grows. That we can then use to... Okay, that's cool. I'll take a few. Never know when you're gonna need that. Oh, we have fish here. Oh, that's great. The fish is great here, actually. You're you're not you're not friendly at all, are you? No. Okay. <laughs> Got some slime balls out of that. Um, looks like we have some fish here as well, which is great as well. Bubble coral. Can I get the fish? I might leave the fish alone for now. Um, right, there was that building up there and also that crystal in that direction. We should probably start heading towards it. Sleeping Mars. I would really love to get a sapling for this tree, though. That would be quite cool if I could, but I don't think I can. Well, the sapling is in the thing, so I mean... Oh, I got one. Perfect. Uh, maybe I need more than one. Maybe I need, like, four, like the dark oak. I don't actually know. Um, again, we could always come back. I'm gonna hope that one. I'm gonna. I'm gonna think one is enough. I'm gonna think one is enough. I may regret that decision, but uh, we'll see. All right. Looks like we got some climbing to do. Uh, that's a big slime. I'd rather not deal with that guy. Um, right. Time to go up. <laughs> I'll meet you at the top. All right, here we are at the top. Looking even more interesting with these things hanging down. We got some more cave system over here. Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, hold the phone. Hold the phone. We got crystals. Okay. All right, let's see. Cave grass. Um, Some sort of vine. Cave moss and stone stalactite. Cave bush. Wait. Bush. Can I get food from these? <laughs> um, cave bush. I wonder if that spreads. I'm gonna take a few. Because why not? Um, yeah, there we go. Gonna take seven. 
And you're gonna be annoying. Now, what do we have here? Aurora Crystal, huh? Now, is this the crystal we have been looking for or not? That is the question, and hopefully that will be answered very, very soon. Looks like we have a lot of it here, actually. We got a lot of it here by the water. That's very, very awesome and cool. I'm gonna try and break this. <gasps> yes! Yes, we got the crystal shards! <laughs> it is through these crystals. That's amazing. That's awesome. That's really great. This is less great, though. Being attacked. Okay, this is a lot of slimes. Um, the slime balls even useful for me at this point in time. Can I even use slime balls for anything? No? Okay, that's great. But I don't even care. We have these crystals now. <laughs> we can use them to make lanterns. We can make the crystal block itself. We can make more lanterns. We can make eyes of ender, apparently, using ender gen, uh, amber gems. We can, of course, use it to make the end for dummies. And even more lanterns. And in the infusion pedestal, we can make crystallite boots using terminite boots. How do we even make a pedestal? We need obsidian. Right. Okay, I'm definitely going to take a few of these. And by few, I mean stacks upon stacks, I think. I think I'm literally going to take this whole, like, thing. Um, because it seems useful and I'm probably going to need it. So, yeah. Maybe not take the whole thing. Maybe leave a little bit. Maybe leave a little bit. Yeah, something like that. Then I'm going to take it. A little bit from these. <laughs> oh man, that's so good. I'm so happy we found this. This place is amazing though. <gasps> Whoa, hello, hello, hello. You seem very angry. You seem very angry. I do not like this situation whatsoever. I do not want to die right now. Right now would be a very bad time for me to die. Uh, you are an issue, sir. Sir, you're an issue. You're a very big issue at this point in time. That was way too close for comfort. That was way too close for comfort. That was extremely close for everything going completely wrong. <laughs> that so far has been going right. Everything almost went entirely too wrong. I, re I must admit though, I really love this biome. Like the ambience as well. I'm gonna get like two stacks of this, I don't care. Um, the ambience is amazing. The crystals are beautiful. I am tempted to, instead of living at our old tree house, I'm tempted to live here. Like I am full on tempted to make a base, a permanent base that is, in an area like this. Because this place, like imagine having a hut here with the trees on the side, having the view over this water we can have fish that spawn in occasionally we have these crystals we have these trees we have this cool cave system like i'm gonna i'm gonna mark it here i'm gonna mark it right here how do i make a bookmark uh b potential base i'm gonna do i'm gonna do that it's aqua so we can see uh actually i should i should probably uh change this to something some something i can actually see there we go now it looks dangery gold i'm gonna make it gold potential base i think this area is really really awesome and it looks like it continues i would love to see this area over here because that seems even like it it continues i want to see this type of like what this is over here um but first i really really want to check out this shipwreck so let's go do that no way look at this <laughs> Look at this. So that is what that is. Look at it. All right. I'm currently on top of a tree, right? I'm just going to slowly turn. Look at that. Like, look at it. It's beautiful. This view right here is amazing. That, that's, a, that's a screenshot right there. And look, we have another type of biome back there. Another type of biome that I would love to check out. We also have probably another shipwreck over there. But we are running out of time for this episode. I want to check out that. I want to check out that. And then we'll end the episode up there. And then I need to think. Because <laughs> I kind of really want to live here. 
Um, yeah, I really want to live here. Um, and yeah, we're probably in the next episode going to explore that and also see what on earth that biome is because that it looks pretty as well. <laughs> but let me get up to that shipwreck over there and let's see what that's about. All right, here we are. I'm not expecting much, but I'm hoping for an ender chest or something maybe like in the other ones, but I'm not expecting there to be any loot in like the normal chests and whatnot. Wait a minute. I can make enchantment tables. I can make enchantment tables. I can break the bookshelves to get books. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to make this thing. <laughs> uh, that's amazing. That's great. Um, right. Pedestal. Is there anything on the pedestal? There was. Perfect. And the chest right there. Boom. Done. Um, that's an anvil. We don't really need that. We have another one back at home. Um, right. Okay. That's also a barrel. I think I'll take the barrel, actually. Because they're cool. They look cool. I think that is it though. Don't really want the the brewing stands. I think I have those back home as well. Right. Guys, I am going to call it an episode right here. Oh, another barrel. I really hope you have enjoyed this one. I certainly have. This has been an amazing discovery. Um, I need to get back so I can actually make the ender dust because I currently don't have this on me. Um, so I need to get back to my tower. I need to make that a dust and then we can make the end for dummies book. Um, and we we can actually make an enchantment table if we get our hands on obsidian. Which I don't know if it generates throughout the world at all or if it's only generating at the at the at like the Dragon Island. Um, but yeah, that is good to know as well. So guys, let me know, should we live in this biome? Because I'm very close to saying, you know what, let's live in this biome. So let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. I'm thinking a house right there. I'm thinking a house right there, maybe something over there to look at those crystals. Just that place to look at the crystals, that's all I want. <laughs> um, yeah, should we put a base here? Because this whole thing is crystals and it's an amazing view. So if we had like a house here somewhere, I think right here, and then maybe an observatory tower or something. I don't know. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Guys. That's another end city. This is another end city. This right here and this. I don't think I'm quite ready to take it on though. <laughs> right. Okay. This is cool. Guys, I'm going to end it here. Really hope you have enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to leave it a like and subscribe if you haven't done so yet. And I hope to see you in the next one. Should we make our base here? Our permanent base? Should we make it here? Let me know down below. Anyways, hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day and goodbye.